There's an enormous number of classic skis here in the race code store. All of these Speedmax classic models feature a special technology, cold base bonding technology. The base is fixed to the ski in a very gentle process and the results are there to be seen. The wax can penetrate the base much more effectively. Finish first is also used on all Speedmax skis. Base grinding is much better and finer as a result. Let us begin with the Speedmax Classic Plus, which is designed for temperatures of minus 5 degrees and warmer. You can say that this is an all-round ski, which is in frequent use. The second model, with a graphite base, is the Speedmax Classic Cold, for temperatures of minus 2 degrees and colder. The third classic model has a special base, the Speedmax Classic C Special. You can see the transparent base really well here. This is for a narrow range in terms of snow conditions. This is ideal for coarse grain snow, where this model gives you top performance, where others struggle. Those were the three climbing wax skis. Now let us turn to a climbing waxless ski, the Speedmax Classic Zero Plus, with a three-section base in the climbing zone. If you want to guarantee an outstanding kick action and good gliding performance, especially in a difficult range around zero degrees, climbing wax skis are not always the best choice. The skis begin to ice up and clumps of snow can start to build up in the climbing zone. This is not the case here though, because there is simply no wax and therefore no water binding and no icing up. This ski really ought to have a fixed place in any racer's ski bag. When I look at these four models, I hope, of course, that some may have already made their choices. And all these skis, which are slumbering here, they will come to life at some point, and I'm sure they will be successful at the next World Championships. And who knows, perhaps the right ski is also among them for you too, as a racer or recreational skier. Have fun with them.